Today on Animal Fact Files, we're discussing wheel bugs. These insects are part of the true bug order. They get their common name from the wheel shaped projection on their back. This also looks like a gear with anywhere from 8 to 12 spokes. Currently, it's unknown why wheel bugs have this bump on their back, but some hypothesize it could be a means of intimidating predators. I know I find them intimidating, though it's not just because of their unique appearance. It's easy to identify an adult wheel bug because they're the only bugs in their range that have that iconic wheel. Wheel bugs live in North and Central America, and they can be found in places where their prey is plentiful. Wheel bugs are a type of assassin bug. Both adults and nymphs hunt and eat other animals. They're often found in areas with flowers, fruits, trees, and meadows. Here, they hunt caterpillars, sawflies, aphids, locusts, butterflies, and even stink bugs. Many of their prey are considered pests to humans, so having wheel bugs around can be beneficial. They use their long front legs to hold captured prey in place. Wheel bugs have a needle like proboscis that pierces and injects enzymatic fluid into prey, which immobilizes the unfortunate animal within half a minute and dissolves its insides. The wheel bug then uses its proboscis like a straw to suck the juices up. While they can't dissolve human organs, their piercing bite can be extremely painful and is often described as worse than a hornet sting. So don't mess with a wheel bug. Female wheel bugs are larger than males, and these insects can reach over an inch in length as adults. Adults are also able to slowly fly, but are most often seen walking. Wheel bug nymphs look drastically different from the adults. They lack flight capable wings and have no wheel to speak of. Nymphs come in brighter colors, with the smallest nymphs appearing bright red. As they get older, they lose this color and become more brown. Adult females have bright orange sacs on their abdomen that were once believed to produce a putrid odor, but it has since been discovered these sacs aren't responsible for this smell. In fact, the orange sacs may actually produce a pleasant aroma and it's a different gland altogether that makes the wheel bug stinky when under stress. The orange sacs may have something to do with mating, because only the females have them. Wheel bugs begin life as an egg. In fall, a female lays 40 to nearly 200 bottle-shaped eggs in a honeycomb-like cluster. These are laid typically no more than 4 feet above the ground and the eggs are coated with a cement-like substance believed to keep them safe from weather and predators. Most animals know not to mess with a wheel bug, but they're still taken by parasitic wasps. Wheel bug eggs overwinter and hatch in the spring. It takes about three months for them to develop into adults. They mate in late summer and die shortly after. For more facts on wheel bugs, check out the links below. Give a thumbs up if you learned something new today. Thank you to our patrons, Spike Spiegel 93 Dad, and everyone else for their support of this channel. And thank you for watching Animal Fact Files.